Yes! Intercepted user lurk! Are we gonna return it? And we do Greedy Williams all the way for the interception. Oh, dance on him, bro. That is going to be the first of many for Greedy. Hey, guys, welcome back to the channel here. We're going to be doing another NFL prospect 10-year simulation. This time we're going to be taking on no one other than Greedy Williams. We're going to put him on the Lions, and you might wonder why. I think it would be a good fit. The Lions pick, I would say, uh, top 15-ish. So, yeah, I mean, yeah, I could see him going to the Lions. And especially, I really like the fit because if you pair him with Darius Slay, that's a nasty matchup. I mean, we're going to get a lot of chances, I would think, because, you know, not a lot of quarterbacks are going to want to throw the way of Slay. So, I feel like Greedy Williams will get his chances here in Detroit go ahead and show you how I made him I made him myself so 6'3 183 21 coming from LSU here he's gonna start with an 82 overall he did run a 4'3 so I did give him decently high speed with a 93 decent acceleration nice agility and of course I did give him some decent press and man coverage and decent zone coverage so I think this is a decent uh, start for Greedy Williams. I hope he would upgrade fast. He does have quick development. I didn't give him star. Just wanted to keep him with quick development and see how he develops from there. But we're going to go ahead and hop into the first game here against the Jets. And then we'll do the 10-year simulation. All right, coming onto the field for the first time here. Playing with Greedy Williams. We're going to be on Robbie Anderson, which should be a fun matchup. Take it on the Jets. We'll see if we can get a pick here from Sam Darnold. Oh, no. That's on me. Ooh, I was going for the strip. Okay. I see you. Throwing my way already. Okay. Definitely that was on me, allowing that completed pass. I'm not going to lie. I'm not the best um, corner. I don't play corner much, actually. So this, this should be fun. We'll see if Robbie Anderson just straight up burns me or not. All right, it's a run. Stuff it up. Yes, we got Snacks Harrison up in here. So shouldn't be going very far in the run game. So I'm hoping they do pass it a lot. I'm definitely going to be blitzing and uh, calling man coverage a lot. I want to try to get some chances here. This time we're going to be on a noon one. Shouldn't be as bad of a matchup as Anderson. Oh, he would have had me with the double move there. He That, that was very close. We almost got burnt there. I did not expect a double move. All right. We're going to be lined up against Robbie Anderson here. Let's see what we can do. Audibling the play. Robbie Anderson. You want him deep. <gasps> okay. Wow, dude. We're getting freaking shredded out here. I'm just not used to these routes. And Sam Darnold helps us out there. That would have been embarrassing. Robbie Anderson with the comeback move? Nasty, dude. All right. Well, our defense was able to uh, cause a good field position for us. I'm going to go ahead and blitz here. See if we can get that safety. What the crap? I was coming in off the edge. Hot, bro. I wanted that safety. Um, They're going three wide, really. Okay. Well, I, I can't blitz here. So we're going to be in a tough situation. I'm going to have to hope my D-line can play well because I'm gonna have to play the receiver just in case this is a pass it's not gonna be a pass Crowell gets up to the five so now this is definitely gonna be a pass I would say for sure so we're gonna go man coverage I'm gonna be on a noon here and we'll see what route they got him running I want to pick though that's for sure oh he's gonna toss it out to Powell on the screen and they're not going anywhere sam donald is two of three right now and they're gonna have to punt it away well thankfully we're able to score seven here so we got an early lead and we're playing on the noon one which is a better matchup than anderson i would i would think they're gonna hand it off to crowell who is going nowhere right now they're trying to run the ball not very successful and this should take an end to the first Actually, there might be enough time to get another playoff if they want. 
We're going to be on a noon one once more. Come on, Sam Darnold. You know you want to throw my way. Stop running the ball, bro. I want to pick out here. But that's going to take an end right there to the first. All right, I'm not sure how this whole pressing mechanic works, but we'll see if we can maybe try to blow him off the line of scrimmage. Come on. Oh, no. He gets it to the running back. We had a nasty press there, dude. We made him go off to the left, and I was really hoping he would throw my way there, but he didn't. Oh, it's going to be tough to get an interception, I would say, because I'm not the best, as you guys can see here at the cornerback. But we'll see if we can learn it on the fly here. Man, they, they really want to pound this ball, but I just don't think it's going to work. We got Snacks Harrison up in here, and interiorly, the Lions are actually decent. So I don't think it's going to work that much just running the ball. So I'm hoping they start throwing my way so I can get some picks. Because we do have Slay out here, so I would think that they would want to throw my way. Oh, we bombs it to Anderson. How? We called cover four. Did I miss something? That had to have been a blown coverage. I mean, we called cover four there. Should have covered the deep route, and somehow we got beat deep by Anderson. And that's, that's just bad. I think that was Slay. Oh, no, that was Quinn. Or, yeah, there was just nobody there. I'm pretty sure that was a blow coverage. After a false start, it is going to back him up a little bit. We're going to be playing in the slot, and I'm not going to lie. I don't know how I feel about this. I'm not the best in the slot for sure. That's a run, though. For sure, and Crowell is four rushes for two yards right now, and he is out here struggling. We're going to go man coverage again. See, I have faith in Darius Slay, so I feel like if we play good here in man coverage, I don't think we should get beat. Man, another run, really? It's not working out, New York. Come on. All right, cover one on a noon one. Third and 15, big play. Big play, and I broke it up. I wanted that pick so bad, dude. I could taste it. I was coming back on that ball like, boy, I would have got that pick, and that would have been a pick six for sure, dude. That's tough. That's so tough. Well, the Jets get a freaking safety on us, and you, you've got to be joking me. So now we're down here by two? Oh, I'm super heated about not getting that interception. I can't lie. Okay, that's on me again. I, I should have had an interception, man. Sam Darnold is throwing the ball a little bit wild, though. I'm not. His accuracies are just not there at this moment. I mean, he is a rookie right now. I guess he does have the updated overall. He's just missing passes out here. That's another one I should have been burnt on. I probably should be pressing more as well, if we're being honest. And Powell is just getting stuffed. A little bit of yards. I mean, not much. Ooh, this is a matchup I want, dude. We're on Anderson. We'll see what he can do. He can fly, but so can we. Oh, he misses. Sam Darnold just throws it into the turf there. And I think that was going to be a corner move by Anderson, and I was ready. I was a freaking ready for the ball there, and I wanted the interception, but we're going to cause a three and out. Man, the, the Jets are scoring, but it's on defense, and it's getting irritating out here. I mean, we're playing good defense. It's just what the crap is our offense doing? I mean, Jesus. They're going to toss it to Matthews, and he gets a first. New York's going to call a timeout, and they're going to try to get points here before half. All right, we're not going to have to really worry about Anunwa's speed here, so I'm going to try to blow him off the line of scrimmage, maybe. If we can get, a, I don't want to actually get a false start. Oh, yes! Intercepted! That's what I want to see. I'm blocking for you, bro. Yes! Picked off there. What a play, dude. He read that like freaking... That was insane. I, we were playing cover three there. So I was going to bite on it, but I didn't want to blow my coverage. But we get the interception. Not us, but our teammate. And we'll see if Detroit can do anything with it. They get a touchdown. Nice. We're back out on the field with 20 seconds remaining. I wouldn't think that the Jets would want to do anything here. But they're lining up three wide. But, uh, yeah, it is going to be a run. And Powell's there. I was going for the strip. Wow. The Jets are actually trying to do something here. Well, the Jets actually want to try to get a drive going here with 18 seconds. 
Throw my way, bro. Throw my way. Oh, he's going to throw Matthew's way. They're going to call another timeout. They might have a chance, actually, to go for a Hail Mary. Unless they get a 20-yard pass, they could quickly get up to the line and maybe just clock it. But I don't see that. Corner. You know you want it. Come on. Oh, he's going to throw it there, I believe. Crap. I really think he's going to throw it my way before he got sacked. We would have had an interception, but either way, that's going to take an end to the first half here and go ahead and hop into the second half. So our offense can't do anything to start it off, but we're still in the lead 21 to 16. Lined up under center. I'm pretty sure it's a run, but we got to be prepared here. Oh, no. I thought we broke it up, dude. All right, they're throwing at us right now, dude. They're throwing at us, and we're getting taken out of the game for some reason. Second and 11 now. Something happened there. Must have been some penalty, but it's going to be a second and 11. I really want an interception before this game's over. I've had chances, and I've kind of blown it. Oh, he's going to toss it across the middle, and it's going to fall incomplete. Now it's going to be a long third down. For the Ruck here, Sam Darnold. So I'm hoping that we can get a chance here. We're going to be on Robbie Anderson. A tough matchup indeed for us. But we'll see if we can hold up. Oh, he's going to toss it underneath the Powell. And it's going nowhere. And it's going to be a fourth and three here. They're going to have to punt it away. Man, our offense just cannot move. 21 to 16 still. Oh, come on, man. Can you at least throw my way, Sam Darnold? Give me a chance out here. I've only gotten thrown my way like two or three times, and I'm calling man coverage about every play. Maybe if we, we're going to have to bait him. We're going to have to freaking bait him. Let's go ahead and see if we can throw Robbie Anderson off the line here. It's going to be a run to Crowell. A pretty big hole there. Gets a decent gain. All right, we're going to be lined up on a noon where this is a little different. It's in a tight formation. Oh, no. I held it. Oh, come on, bro. What? I dropped it? Look at this replay. I was there. I'm holding triangle. I'm breaking on that ball like a... Freaking heat sinking missile? Oh my. I can't believe it. I can't believe it. That should have been an interception. Crap. Oh, Robbie Anderson. Oh no. Get there. Get there. Yes. Oh man. We're all over the passing game for the Jets right now. I'm just heated that we didn't get that pick right there, dude. Really heated, but it's tough. It is what it is. All right, well, our offense gives us a, a decent lead here, so I'm going to play a little bit risky going for that interception. Two-score game, fourth quarter. I think we can be a little bit risky here. No, I undercut it too much. I knew it was that route as well. I knew it was bench. I thought that we could do it. Man, that's that's unfortunate. We would have had another interception there if I read it correctly. I did not think that Sam Darnold could just fit it in that perfectly. And we know it's going to be passes as well, most likely. Actually, a draw play here. Powell eh, gets a decent little gain there. Five. All right, man. I need to step up here. I need to freaking play well. I'm going to get on Quincy Anunwa here. We're going to try to throw him off his route. See if we can get a nice press. They're running the ball for some reason, dude. But it's working. Get up to the 33. I'm just going to try to chew some clock down, maybe. Or at least hope they try to run it more. Because that's probably a poor decision on their part. Considering it's a two-possession game. They're going empty. This is our chance. Yes! Intercepted user lurk. Are we going to return it? And we do Greedy Williams all the way for the interception. Oh, dance on him, bro. That is going to be the first of many for Greedy. 
Yes, dude, user lurking it out here. Sam Darnold throws a horrible pass, and that is a pick six all the freaking way. That feels so good, dude. It feels so good. And we back out here, bro. Throw my way again, Sam Darnold. Give me another. Now they got me on Jermaine Curse, who should be a better matchup, actually. They're going to toss it underneath to the tight end. Dude, playing cornerback is actually pretty fun. I've actually enjoyed this game a lot. Maybe I should store, start up a cornerback career mode. Let me know what you guys would think about potentially seeing a Greedy Williams career mode. That might be a fun one. All right, Sam Darnold, you know you want to throw it deep. Go ahead and do it. And he gets sacked. Kittered in there. Our defense is wreaking havoc on New York right now, dude. They got no answers. We're sending a mid blitz. The ball's going to come out very quickly, in my opinion. And we're going to have our chance here once more. Oh, he's got to bomb it. He catches it. Matthews, oh. After another false start for New York, it's going to bounce him back to a first and 15. But like I was saying, I think I should have played a little bit off there and I could have gotten an interception, which is unfortunate for sure. They're just going to toss it to the running back who's got all day. Who was on him? We were in man coverage there. Not that it matters much, but I don't know who was on him. I mean, they just completely blew their coverage. All right, Did, I mean, the Jets are getting close to the end zone. Definitely don't want to give up a touchdown on my part. See if we can get ourselves a nice little interception, maybe? Oh, I'm lucky. I'm lucky. Anuma ran that post route. I thought it was going to be the corner route. And thankfully, I had safety help, or that would have been a touchdown. That would have been a touchdown. So I got to play this a little bit safer. I probably should be playing inside anyway, because if we give up an outside route, I mean, who cares, really? Oh, we're all over that. Powell! Is that a touchdown? Oh, wow. that That's not a good matchup. Our, that might be a touchdown for the tight end there. Woo! That was an overthrow, and that was thankfully one because we would have got a touchdown on us right there. I want to get up and press, but if I get too close, I keep on getting called for offside. So I'm going to play it safe. Yes! Intercepted. That's what I'm talking about. Can we return it again? We have insane speed. Is it the second pick six for Greedy Williams? I think it is, and it's going to be. We're going to return it again. The second pick six, 100-yard return here for Greedy, and that's nasty, bro. Sam Darnold tests us, and why would you do that when Greedy Williams is 6'3"? He's a monster, and... He's out here trying to break records, bro. And that's our second interception of our first game. And that's going to be a dub for us. All right, so a great start for us on our first game here. We ended up getting two picks late. I was worried we wouldn't get any. Matthew Stafford actually played pretty well, too. Um, but, uh, yeah, we get two interceptions, two touchdowns as well. So both picks go for touchdowns, which is pretty nasty. And, yeah, great start for us. So I'm excited to go ahead and simulate forward here. We'll go ahead and simulate forward to the end of the year just to see what we did as a rookie. And then we'll do the 10-year simulation and see what Greedy Williams was able to accomplish in that time span. All right, guys, so we're at the end of the year here with Greedy Williams. He is up to a... Let's check it out here. An 89 overall, so he upgraded quite well, actually. I mean, he had like five or six upgrade points. That's pretty decent. Um, but unfortunately, you know, we are Detroit, so we're going to finish 5 and 10. Um, let's go ahead and check out the stats, though. Let's go ahead and see what we did. It looks like offensively, we played decently. Def see, like, I don't get how we don't make the playoffs. If we're 8th in offensive yards and 13th. In defensive yards? Like, what is that? How don't you make the playoffs? Where are we at? Oh, wow. We had 69 tackles. That's decent as a corner. 87 total tackles. Wow, dude. We're like third on the team in tackles as a corner. We had three tackles for loss, a half sack. Only four interceptions. 
This is unfortunate for sure because I are we at least a top interception on the team here? Wow, Slay didn't have any. What what was Slay doing out here? Um, but yeah, that's unfortunate. So that means we only had two interceptions the whole season after our game that we had two in. Did we at least get any more touch? Wow, we only had two touchdowns. Okay, so only two picks after the game we played in. Quickly check out the yearly awards. Drew Brees wins MVP. And we're not in that conversation, obviously. NFC, I just want to see if we're in any of the categories. So, we're not in Defensive Player of the Year. What about Defensive Rookie? Crap. Well, we're third. Dante Jackson's above us, which is not good because he's a former cornerback, too. So, that's a little bit unfortunate for us. Are we at least in the best? I bet we're not in the best defensive back. Oh, wow. We are. Nice. Coming in at number seven in our rookie year and best DB. I'll take that for sure. In the NFC, I don't know if we made the Pro Bowl or not, but that's still a decent start to our rookie year. Four interceptions. Third team in tackles. Uh, we, I mean, we're one of the top best DBs in the NFC, so I'm happy with our performance of Greedy Williams already up to an 89 overall. So I'm excited to go ahead and get this 10-year simulation underway. So at the end of this 10-year span here, we are, let's go ahead and check it out. We're 99 overall. So we're 31. Um, oh, wow, dude. Our stats are outrageous. We went up in speed a lot. We're the number one ranked cornerback in the league. So after 10 years, Greedy Williams comes out. He puts himself as the number one corner in the league. Oh, my. His tackling is at 94. He's got great man coverage, great zone coverage. Um, awareness, 99. I mean, everything you would want for an all-time cornerback. And we'll go ahead and see what kind of stats he's had over his career here. So let's go ahead and go to my player. I believe we can find it in there. Stats and contracts. So we'll go ahead and check out the stats he's had. So we had those four interceptions his first year. He's always had a lot of tackles. When you check out his tackles here, he's had a lot. Not a lot in the terms of picks, though. He's had four 2, 4, 3, 1, 3, 1, 0, 1, and then 0. So he hasn't had a whole lot of interceptions over his career, which is unfortunate. Um, how many touchdowns does he have? He only has 3 touchdowns. Okay, so a bit underperforming here in the interceptions category, which is unfortunate. What about sacks? We've never had a season with a full sack. Well, we have been a... Solid tackler. I'd love to see what his contract is. Uh, we have one year remaining on our contract here. Uh, it's an 11.9 cap hit. So we're not... I mean, we're getting paid 12 mil pretty much as a corner, which isn't bad. But we did haven't had an outstanding, you know, contract here. What about awards? Undrafted in 2018. So we've never had an award. Dang, okay, well, I mean, not outrageous 10-year stats. I mean, about average, as you would see here. So, nothing too special about Grady Williams in this 10-year simulation. He never won any awards over this 10-year span. Not the most interceptions. I mean, he's been a solid tackler, but he was up to a 99 overall, which I don't get how he didn't have better stats than that. Maybe it's just, you know, Detroit is possibly cursed. Uh, because we know they do have playoff problems. Actually, can we check out if we've ever won a playoff game? How do we check that out? Actually, we can go ahead and check. I know how we check that out. All right, so we can go to stats. We can go to uh, career stats. Oh, this will show us a lot. Okay, so we have 716 tackles. This is where I should have went in the first place. 865 total tackles altogether. Um, 19 tackles for loss, 19 interceptions, which is a bit on the low side, if we're being honest. For 10 years, that's not even 
averaging like two a year. So that's that's not good. That's really not what you'd want to see there. Um, let's go ahead and check out. I think if we go to the Hall of Fame stats, we can go to the yeah NFL records. Is it there? No. Okay, I need to get better at this, man. A legacy leaderboard. This is where it'll be. We don't have a Super Bowl. Holy crap. So we don't have a Super Bowl. We don't have a championship. And we don't even have any yearly awards. So that's probably... That's a really bad 10-year span here for Greedy. I thought he was going to be a monster. Didn't prove so. So that's going to be it for this 10-year simulation. Let me know who you guys want to see next. For the next prospect, I do simulate 10 years. And let me know if you guys are enjoying this series or not. And if you are, make sure you do hit that sub button. That would be greatly appreciated. Also, I want to give a huge shout out to Powerlifter for being my first supporter on Patreon. If you don't know what that is, you guys can go and donate to me there. And help me be able to do YouTube full time once I reach my goal. But if you can't, I fully understand it. Just watching is good enough. And I will see you guys next episode. Peace out.